Hi guys and welcome to this video where I'm going to show you how to use the parental control functions in the My Moves for iPhone and iPad application. Initially I go into the menu in the upper left corner and go into settings. Scroll down a little bit to locate the parental controls section, that's the one here. Click that and by default this is, uh, this is disabled so I'll just turn it on and input uh, my preferred pin code you just input whatever you prefer like this and then the first section here is called maximum allowed rating um, and you have two sections here one for uh, standard titles and one for TV series both of them are set by default to the maximum level so if you just enable parental controls like this you won't have any um, any limitations in uh, in the title shown but I'll just go in here and set that to PG and I'll do the same for the TV series that is the level that that I'm comfortable with before for my children then there is the allowed unrating uh, section here if a title doesn't have a rating uh, either because it specifically is unrated or uh, if the title doesn't have a rating in our metadata which uh, however should be rare then uh, titles will be shown if you if you have the allow unrated uh, checkbox here uh, enabled so i strongly recommend that you do not enable uh, unrated titles because specifically uh, in in the united states it's very common to to have titles that are uh, specifically marked unrated even though they are not in any way intended for children it's uh, it's pretty stupid but uh, but that's the way it is in america so now I'll just go back into uh, to the menu here and back into my collection and you'll see that my uh, collection of tiles is now uh, more limited than it was before and if I go into the button up here in the upper right corner you can see the parental controls is active so now it's displaying only the tiles that I'm allowing through parental controls so if I click here shows me that it's limited to PG and I can click this and enter my pin code like this and I'll now see all my titles so it's, it's deactivated and I could click here to activate it again so I'm going to show you another thing that you can do with um, with the parental controls if I go into a, a title here say 16 16 blocks is, is certainly not really uh, something that my children should see so I can just go into the title I click show more on the on the personal uh, data area here I'll click on uh, on categories and I'll just add a category here saying parents only click done click done And another way could be to go into a children's title here and say Safe for Kids. So now I have two different categories in my collection and I could add these to all of the titles that, that I prefer. So if I go back into settings and back into the current parental control section I'll have to enter my pin code to get in there just so that anyone else couldn't just change the settings I have an option here saying block items that are inside a category or block items that are outside a category so I potentially could, could go in here and select my safe for kids group so anything that are outside the category safe for kids will now be blocked naturally as I only added that to one title it will mean that uh, I'm going to get a very small collection to view um, the alternative here was that I in the block inside category I could block titles that were marked parents only so it could 
potentially be used in combination with allowing unrated titles. You could specifically go in and block something that you have you have marked uh, in a specific category. The other options you have uh, in parental controls is that you can disallow collection editing if you enable this. And you can disable uh, watch marking as well if you in enable this one. This way you can be sure it's safe to pass around your device if you are in a group of, uh, of friends or if your children are, are handling the device as well. And last thing you can do is that you can fully block the access to settings so that no one is, is changing the settings on, uh, on your device. So this completes the, the video on how to use the parental controls functions in the MyMovies for iPhone and iPad application. Thank you for watching.